A new trolley is connecting Santa Barbara's Funk Zone, Waterfront, and the downtown. News Channel's John Palminteri is live. John, this is expected to be a big win for all the areas. A lot of fun on that today. The visitor trolley is a way to move people into the retail and restaurant areas and move them around as well, especially those who can't necessarily always get there on foot or by driving. Hello. Got your tickets, I see. Welcome aboard, everybody. A new way to get around from the waterfront and funk zone to downtown and back is now on a roll. It's a way to put more people in motion, and we were on the first ride of the day. They want some uh, a shuttle to bring people from the funk zone waterfront area into in the heart of downtown and vice versa. So that way we have this great circulation. The new visitor trolley is a collaboration between the downtown organization, Visit Santa Barbara, the South Coast Chamber of Commerce, and the city of Santa Barbara. There are four stops on the route, with the very first one starting right here at the bottom of State Street near Mason Street, right outside of the Hotel Californian. Love it. Yeah, I love it. It's really cool. The route includes Chapala Street, Anapamu Garden, Anacapa Street, and Cabrillo Boulevard before returning to State Street. The trolley comes around every half hour from 11 a.m. to 5 p.m. Friday through Monday. Tickets are $1 for each ride and tickets are available at the visitor center. If you're paying on board, it's a dollar, but the driver does not make change. We actually look at the, at the ad here and then we looked at the location where we're gonna be picked up and we waited. This kind of service was paused when the downtown shuttle stopped running during the pandemic and did not resume. The community has really wanted to bring a trolley into yeah. existence in terms of getting people around. The retail business community has wanted to be able to circulate uh, visitors. Okay. Among the riders was a two-year-old celebrating his birthday. He loves buses, so we found out that there's going to be a new trolley route, and uh, yeah, just perfect timing in the morning. <laughs> He's always just said bus, and he always points at buses, but this is the first time he got to just hop on one and ride it in real time. The trolley has an open air field, which is very comfortable on a hot summer day. I've already walked all the way to the end of the pier and back, so we were happy to know that there was gonna, there's a trolley. <laughs> the trolley can not only save you a few steps, but it's also a nice mini tour of the area. We live in such a beautiful place and that's what, uh, you know, getting out and being able to see it with the open air and getting around town. Yeah, I think it's a great idea. Back here to State and Mason Street. Day news at 11 a.m. We were on the trolley going live and I've also posted on social media all the information you need. And since then, I've had so many people message me. They're so interested in going on this and they want to know how long it's going to be rolling. Well, the answer to that is for now, it's going to go from now till Labor Day. But possibly, if all goes well, it could go even longer. Reporting live in Santa Barbara, I'm News Channel reporter John Palmentary. Very good, John. Thank you. The food